Okay, so I've just done a little video to show you the difference between the long wire antenna and the 40 meter loop antenna. I've taken the NFED half wave antenna down and replaced it with the 40 meter loop and the difference in the noise levels and the signal to noise levels is absolutely fantastic. So I hope you like the video. <laughs> Hello, welcome back to my shack. It's Ricky Gisera Welder X. I've not made a video for a while. Not much has changed in the shack, to be honest with you. Uh, biggest thing is uh, I've put a 40 metre loop antenna up instead of the uh, N fed half wave antenna, which I had, the slow fan antenna. Uh, and I want to show you the video just to show you what the difference in the noise levels made. Um, Oh, I have added the ICOM 7100 to the shack, but I'll do another video of that. Basically, let me move this off the way. You'll see at the moment, this is showing FT8 on uh, 15 meters. You see the signal levels. This is on my long wire. So the long wire is around about uh, 160 feet long. It goes down to the bottom of the garden, uh, goes across and comes back to the house, sort of a U-shape, so it fits into the garden, and it works very well. Uh, you can notice the signals are, are pretty good, and the noise level, when it drops off the signal, sort of drops down to zero. But if you notice the waterfall, it's, uh, it's pretty much blue at the bottom side of it, but that's on the long wire. Now I was, it was a little bit noisier on the NFED half wave sloper, so I decided to change the sloper and put a 40 meter loop up uh, because I heard they were a lot better, uh, signal to noise ratio was a lot better on it. So that's the long wire at the moment. Now you'll see when I switch it over to the loop, you notice the signal and you notice the blue on the bottom on the, on the spectrum scope. That now is on the loop. Look at the difference in the noise level on the bottom. The signals are still there. So I'm getting about an S8, maybe peaking S9. But if you notice the bottom, sorry my finger was getting in the way. If you notice the bottom where the waterfall is, if I switch it over to the long wire, the noise floor increases. Now it's not a lot. But if you're working FT8 or FT4, uh, weak signal mode, it makes a hell of a difference. So that's on the long wire. And that's on the loop. And just look at the difference that makes. Absolutely fantastic. Needless to say, uh, it's on a 2 kilowatt ballon. A 4 to 1 ballon. So basically it goes down. It's, it's sort of a diamond shape at the moment because of the garden and restrictions I've got uh, putting antennas up but it works extremely well so it's uh, I think it's around about 30 foot each leg so 30 foot out 30 foot across 30 foot down and 30 foot back around about uh, works fantastic on 40 meters through to 6 meters uh, I just thought I'd show you it on 15 because 15, it seems to, the noise level seems to show a lot better just for video purposes. Uh, but again, that's on the loop antenna on the bottom and that's on the long wire. And I think you'll agree, it's a, it makes a hell of a difference to the signal to noise ratio. And once again, when the signal pops back up, I've got an S9 on the long wire similar signal on the loop but the, the noise level is drastically dropped so if you're looking for an antenna to go I would definitely suggest uh, a loop antenna especially if you've got suffering from any sort of noise and uh, I'm sure it'll help you out 7-3 from Ricky GZLLZX <laughs> Dun 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 d